Hey, what's going on everyone? In this quick video, I'm going to show you how you can easily update the apps on your iPhone or iPad device. And I'll also be showing you how you can update individual apps and also all of the apps as well. And towards the end of the video, I'll also show you an awesome trick on how you can set up automatic updates. So you'll never have to worry about going into the app store and manually updating the apps every single time. So to begin, I'm just going to show you guys how to update apps. And this is very easily done by going to the app store on your iPhone or iPad. Now, once you're in here, you just want to press on your account, which is on the top right hand corner. Now, once you're in here, you see all the apps that need to be updated. And as you can see, I've got quite a few to update as I haven't gotten around to updating them yet. So if I want to go ahead and update one individual app, I can simply do this just by pressing on the update. And this will just take a couple of moments. And as soon as that square icon appears, the app will start updating. And if I want to go ahead and pause the update, I can simply go ahead and press it again. And if I want to continue the update, I can go ahead and press that as well. And if I want to go ahead and update all apps, I can do that as well just by going to update all. And that will go ahead and update all 60 apps on my iPhone device. So if you want to go ahead and set up automatic app updates, that's very easily done by going into the settings on your iPhone. Now once you're in here, you just want to tap on your account up the top of the iPhone. Now once you're in here, you just want to go to iTunes and App Store. Now once you're in here, you just want to scroll down to automatic downloads and by default, this is automatically turned off. So you can just go ahead and turn this on. And also you have the ability to control the size of the app that you would like to download as it will only automatically download when you're on a Wi-Fi network just to save your mobile data. So there you have it guys, that's two awesome ways on how you can automatically and manually update the apps on your iPhone or iPad device. So if you'd like to see any other videos about iPhones or iPads, please drop your ideas down below as I'll be more than happy to make videos for all of you out there. So again, hopefully this video was helpful for you. And as always, thanks for watching. I'll see you all in the next one.